why mathematics? In some sense, the only subject I could make real sense of because I could, you could explain everything that was happening. So right now, I'm interested in teaching computers about modern research mathematics. So this is computer theorem provers have existed for decades, but it's only relatively recently that they've started to understand what humans are doing uh, in 2022, and that's what I'm interested in. Today, I'm going to be talking about new uses of computers in mathematics. So mathematicians have been using computers for, or for centuries if you count, pre-digital computers. More recently, uh, things like AI and you know, interactive theorem provers and, and other recent tools mean that mathematicians might be able to use computers in new ways. And, and that's the kind of thing I'll be talking about today. So I started formalizing number theory and commutative algebra and actually I found that they were very amenable to formalization. However, uh, it's not good enough just to do parts of mathematics, one has to formalize all of it. One needs a, a big machine that understands all of it. And so recently there has been a push to formalize more geometric, the more geometric side of things. Uh, it's, it's more slow going, but it's certainly possible. It's just harder work. So this whole area of, of using computers in this, in this new way, this area of using computers to prove theorems in mathematics and to verify theorems, it's existed for decades, but the, sort of the, the mainstream mathematician community have really not engaged with it in any way. And I do feel that the systems have got something to offer mathematics. I'm not entirely clear as to what it is, but I, I do feel that these systems have got something to offer the modern mathematician. And so it's important to spread the word. This is one of the reasons I, I speak, just to, just to bring greater awareness to the area, because it's been ignored for decades. People just need to remember that we have established ways of using computers in mathematics, but there are other new ways which are appearing, and those new ways, there is a chance that they will really change the way mathematics is done in the future.